the season of spring weather seems to sing, lovely, lovely days are coming our way. The season of spring blooming, blossoming of nature of all kind that roots unbind. The season of spring binds and fold their wings, diving high into the sky which one could fly. The season of spring, nice sound bells ring, new waves, new style, faces have one smile. Listen to my words. The season of spring is near. Now take a look into my lovely eyes. And one can see that spring is here. My tutorial. To get rid of this alien look, we need some Max Studio Finish Concealer. Go ahead and dab the concealer on your lower eyelid and your upper eyelid. This is what I would call concealer magic. See my left eye and my right eye? My left eye looks a lot more awake than my right eye. I would always invest in a good concealer. It's so essential. That's the basic part of any makeup routine. This is one of my favorite eyeshadow palettes by MAC. This light green color. I totally love it. It looks white, green, and yellow. I will entirely apply this to my eyelid. A lot of people used to tell me that I have Chucky Khan speaking voice. Right now I really do sound like her. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Alright. So now I'll also apply the eyeshadow to my other eyelid. Now I'm going to use my MAC Rated R eyeshadow. It has an olive green yellowish type of shade. You know green is the color of hope. The green traffic light means go. And we want to have a lot of green light this year. Now we are going to use MAC Brill eyeshadow. Leave this green in the innermost corner of your eyes. MAC actually has a black and a brown liquid liner, both are perfect, but I have chosen a black liquid liner that I have applied very, very thin. I really love its texture, the application is so easy. Use very soft strokes to line your upper lash line. The eyeliner will make your eyes pop. Make sure to draw a decent line, really make it thin so that it doesn't look like it's too heavy. We want a very soft, unique look. And now use the rest of the product for your lower lash line and for the outer corners of your eyes. Try to comb your eyebrows with the eyebrow comb. It adds some definition. And then you fill them in with the eyebrow pencil. Easy strokes, remember? We want everything to be soft. Mmm, I think I love this eyebrow. Wonderful. I'm now using Max Translucent Powder. And one of Max Shimmery Blushes. Max Mineralized Blush will help you to define your cheekbones. Use a pink lip pencil and perfectly try to line your lips with it. I honestly think there is no need to splurge in an expensive lip liner. If you have the perfect lip liner color, 
A regular lip liner can also do a wonderful job. I think it's rather important to splurge in a lipstick and in a concealer rather than in a lip liner. Now fill in your lips with this MAC MAC lipstick. That's a real tongue twister right there. I love the eye color and the lip color. I look so springy. MAC also has a wonderfully naturally looking brown lash. I really love this lash because it looks so natural and I'm really really glad that I had one pair of these to show you guys how it looks. Mascara would deliver too much drama, that's why I'll throw it to the side, kick it to the curve. Oh, how I love this water blue eyeliner. The water blue eyeliner goes straight to the waterline where it belongs. And as you can see, my eyes, they pop, they pop but they don't pop too much, yeah. We now need a bobby pin. Such as Paul Mitchell Super Skinny Serum. This is a wonderful product, one of my favorite products. I apply a little bit to my hand and apply it to my hair. By the way, this is a weft. It's Indian Virgin hair. You can order it here via smartheart at AOL.com. It's 400 grams and you'll love this hair. I color customized it myself. It has some ombre going on. So now I section the hair, I pull out a strand and section that strand into three little strands. With my three pieces, I can now start braiding all the way down. and sometimes some hair comes in between but that's normal it needs some little practice and you need some patience and just continue to braid just try to make the braid to look kind of even and then you hide the end of the braid on the other side underneath your hair so you see whether everything is even. Yeah, this looks really good. This looks bohemian. I love that. So now I will fix it with the bobby pin underneath my hair. Now mission accomplished. It really looks bohemian. It doesn't it look good? Now you can go to a party, to a barbecue, just go downtown and go shopping and have fun. Take in some big earrings. This is my recommendation. Um, for instance, Sarah Mari's earrings. She's my friend. She customizes those. If you want to purchase them, contact me via smartheart at AOL.com. Oh, it looks so good, right? Also contact me if you are interested in purchasing my hair. You better try out this look and make a video response right now. And don't forget to hit the thumb up button. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and good luck.